my inability to be happy, or as Joe would say, to appreciate what I had, has caused me to get sick. Now what are we going to do? I'm not even going to get better because my thoughts torment me. And if I can't, if anything happens to my mom, if she gets sick, if she winds up in a nursing home because I can't take care of her or something like that's going to eat me alive. It's going to eat me alive and then I'll never get better. Joe is like, you'll, you'll recover. You have a robust system. Get plenty of rest and vitamin C and all this crap. But he doesn't know that it's deep, deep depression. That it's, that it's caused me to get sick. It shot my immune system to hell. All the stress, all the fear that if anything happened to me. That things have almost happened to me that weren't my fault. Maybe getting hit by a car around here was technically my fault. Because I was using, doing my music, I mean, in, at the corner of someone's driveway. But I really don't think you're in my blind spot. Cars can... Drivers can use that excuse or people would get hit all the time, but whatever. But other times I've always gotten hit. It's not been my fault at all. I'm beyond careful. The fact is, our minds are very powerful and self-fulfilling prophecy. The fact is, I'm miserable because I would have nothing in this life. And we should have been with Joe years ago. We should have been with Joe years ago. We were all sad and then Selena ripped me to fucking shreds. And your mother doesn't want to go. Your mother doesn't want to go. You're a horrible person. You and Joe both acted like we're like Lifetime Movie of the Week or something. Plotting and all this crap. When we both had my mom's best interest at heart. She doesn't know what she wants or what's best for her. And now it's too late. I'm sick. What are we going to do? How is she going to get her shot? How is she not going to get sick if I'm sick? This was my biggest fear and it came to right. It's my own fault. My inability to be fucking happy when my life sucks.